seven yard hash marks there into the field. Earl Johnson, Patrick Collins, Anthony Stafford, behind Jamel Holloway, and they've got Keith Jackson now wide, not wide as a receiver. The tight end. And Holloway looks and throws and hits Shepard, who pitches it back. The ball is fumbled, rolling around on the ground. Nebraska's jumping up and down. Oklahoma's 94 yards away from the promised land with 4-10 to play in the ball game, trailing 17-10. It's become a game of turnovers here in the late going. Holloway keeps the ball and gets it around the corner. Fourth and one, just outside the 15. Holloway keeps it. And gets the first down, fumbles the football. Penalty flag goes down. Nebraska's got the ball. You got a late flag. There was a five-yard face mask live ball against the defense. The fumble was recovered by the, by the defense. It's recovered by all five to win. First down. It is first down Oklahoma up at the 25-yard line. 2.35 to go in the game. Nebraska leads by seven. Holloway's pass across the field is caught. Good catch by Carl Cabanis. Comes out past the 33. Let's it go again, and it is complete to Shepard, and it's a big one. All the way down to the Nebraska 32-yard line. Brian Davis finally brought him down. Never fails. You say the guy's in the hip pocket all night. You turn around, you compliment a guy, and now he gets beaten. See that? He's beaten right off by Shepard. This is a 35-yard play. He's making up ground here, Davis is. Again, he doesn't look back for the football, though. Shepard makes the play. the 32. Two minutes and 21 seconds to play in the game. Holloway pitches it back. It is Spencer Tillman. And Tillman is out of bounds at the Nebraska 23. That's a gain of at least eight. Maybe close to nine yards. 126 to play in the game. 17-10 Nebraska. Oklahoma possesses the ball. Second down at the 17-yard line of Nebraska. This possession started at Oklahoma's six. They have run ten plays so far. And this is a possession for the championship of the Big Eight Conference. Lydell Carr is in at fullback. Tillman's back at halfback. Collins, the other halfback. And Holloway throws. It is Jackson. It is touchdown, Oklahoma. to play in the game. Big play by Jackson, but again, watch number 32, Brian Davis. He's right there and doesn't turn around and look for the football. He's got good inside-out position. Go I'm sorry, Timmy, but they're not going to go for two. I'm a little surprised at it. They're not going. Lasher is out to go for the extra point. They don't do something here. The Sooners get the ball back, and with the wind at their back, they still would have a chance to win it. Taylor's pass underneath, thrown hard, and Vaughn Shepard couldn't pull it in, and now it is fourth down. Well, you're right. Now we'll talk about the clock the other way. This and they give it to Carr, and Carr breaks it, and gets it up to the 47-yard line and picks at least nine tackles. But the presence and pressure of the man in the game has been so terribly obvious. Mark Munford has 15 tackles, recovered a fumble, one sack, and has an interception. So the respective universities and the names of Messrs. Crosworth and Munford will receive $1,000 from Chevrolet for their general scholarship fund. Munford, number 41, in the red, and Bosworth, number 44, in the white. Well-played football game. The big surprise in that both teams put the ball on the ground so often. 
Red Miami, it's off the I think the told you we weren't going to Oklahoma. We told you we weren't going to be cold. Well, you know what it is? Everybody in Dickinson. Hey, it ain't over yet. We got that good second. Excitement is still there. Here we go, Red. 18 seconds remaining now on third down at about 12. A 17-17 time. And Oklahoma has spent its last time out. If they pick up 15 yards, then I think Thompson would have a shot at it. They want to win this thing outright, or they yeah. would have let the clock run out already for yeah. the time the Orange Bowl. Passes away, and Jackson oh. makes a spectacular catch and is knocked out of bounds at the 14-yard line. And time remaining, nine seconds, and time for the kicking team to get on the field. Now, I, you go back and look at that play, and you'll see something very interesting here. Now, watch what Jackson does. He's got Roderick Thomas trying to cover him here. Jackson gives him a push, gets away from him, and makes a spectacular catch. But see, he was just trying to work his way back against Thomas to get to the inside. I'm not so sure he just blocked him out of the way. He was trying to get his position to get back in to make the catch. Boy, he's got some big hands, great talent. Nine seconds, and great Oklahoma now player. can win it outright. 31 seconds. Uh, 31 yards in nine seconds. And Lasher's kick is good. And the Sooners win it with six seconds to go. I say they win it. You've got a penalty flag thrown on Oklahoma because of the celebration on the field, but they don't care. What a great comeback by Oklahoma. By their own admittance, they're not a great come-from-behind team, but they maintained their game plan. They made one quick adjustment, started setting the half back in motion so they could position the safety. They went to the air a little bit more. They came back 2017. Tremendous come-from-behind win by Oklahoma. Of course, you do have six seconds to go. Oklahoma has owned the fourth quarter. It will be assessed on the kickoff, 15 yards. The penalty is for the celebration, having uh, unauthorized people out on the field. Here's the play again to Keith Jackson. It's a well-thrown ball, but I want you to watch Jackson working to the inside. He has as much right to that football as anybody, and he's coming back to get it. Now, here's the contact, because he's working back to the inside. Thomas almost tipped it. Jackson did tip it, caught his own tip, and takes it down, so they set up the field goal. This will give you a better idea how he's working. There's the bump off the line. That's a good play by Thomas. Now, Tom, Thomas does turn, see? Now they both get tangled up there. I think that's incidental contact. That's a tremendous play by a great athlete. The Big 8 Championship. They mark off 15-yard penalty, which means Oklahoma will kick off from the 20. So that moves Nebraska now up the field a goodly ways. The wind, however, is at the back of Thompson, and Thompson, the punter, very strong in his uh, kickoff. So, let's see. From the 20, with six seconds, squib kick fielded up at the 41 by Doug Dalton, a fullback, and Dalton returns the ball to the Sugar Bowl of New Orleans to play the champion of the Southeastern Conference. Hey, back, back up, back up, back up, back up. Big ball game tonight relative to the host team in the uh, Sugar Bowl, LSU and Notre Dame in Baton Rouge. The last play of the game right here. Taylor is taken down. Taken down by Steve Bryant, and the game is over. Oklahoma wins it by a score of 20 to 17. You can feel the momentum change as we headed into the fourth quarter. Well, they all, Oklahoma owned the fourth quarter. No question about it. For 13 points in the fourth quarter. football game this ABC sports exclusive has been brought to you